Hello, Gibraltar here. I just wanted to do a quick tip and trick video on how to put sidechain effects on the OPZ. As of now, there's no sidechain effect in the effects tracks. Um, so you kind of have to just fake the sidechain effect and I'll show you how to do that in this video. Um, first, we're gonna listen to this pattern that I made that we're gonna do the sidechain effect on. It's a simple four in the floor pattern. All right, so the first method I'm gonna show you is um, basically using the note limit on each step. So you could do this in mono and just have one note playing, or um, know that if you're in uh, poly, then uh, it's up to four notes. So we're gonna do it in poly, and we'll go ahead and put a chord in here on each of the four beats. And basically what this does is, oops, when it plays, and uh, we'll extend this in a second, um, to the next beat, it will go ahead and stop the polyphony of the previous step that it's playing and start a new chord. So let's go ahead and listen to what that sounds like. All right. So that's kind of close, but now we need to make it sound more pumpy. So we'll go into the envelope, the green um, section here, and go ahead and start upping the attack, and you'll start hearing the pumping of the side chain coming in. All right, so that's the first method. So um, we'll go on to the second one, which is using the LFO. So what you can do is just have one chord playing, um, or if you want to do more than one, uh, you know, however many you want, uh, using these, uh, you know, it could be four bars long, whatever. Um, so we have a basically chord going on the whole uh, the whole step here, uh, bar. So what you want to do is go to the LFO. Turn this all the way up to 50. Um, turn the rate down to five. What this does is basically every beat, so every four, it will um, re-trigger, it will cycle. Turn this to volume, which is number eight here. And shape, we want to uh, go to 40. So every time it hits, it'll reset. Because sometimes I notice that if you do it at uh, four, which is the uh, regular ramp and then down, um, it'll get out of sync with itself. It's kind of strange. Um, so go to 40 and um, go ahead and press play. All right, so it's not doing exactly what I wanted. But what you can do is go to the yellow page, which is the mixer, and start turning the level down. You should be able to hear it coming in. All right, um, so those are two methods. I like to kind of use them both. So um, what I would do is have something like, um, this, and kind of have both the attack this kind of gives you a little bit more control over what you're doing um, another thing you can do as well is if you want to use you know different chords or uh, maybe a longer bar length you can take all these out go to, I don't know, four bars, and maybe you want to do like, I don't know, A, E, D, or something like that. So, do that. Actually, what we want to do is set the length past, and maybe, uh, you know, do A for a little while.
maybe C. Get the idea. Um, that is how you, uh, you know, kind of fake the sidechain effect on the OPZ. I uh, hope you learned something new and I hope you have a great day. Thanks.